Okay guys, so we just made it here to Petra, Wadi Musa, commonly known as Petra. So we'll show you guys some footage. On this point number one, okay? When you're gonna walk all the way down under the treasury, which means this point, to see it, the famous one, you need like 30, 40 minutes, one walk. Way. Okay. Walk. Okay. And if you wanna go all the way up onto the monastery, to see this point, which means the last one, uh, this is Indiana Jones. Where is that? Sacrifice Indiana Jones. You have to take two horse. You would take you all the way up. Oh, wow. And you will take a picture up. And then Can you, you mark it for me? I want to go there tomorrow. Tomorrow? Yeah. So from here, okay. they will take you. There's another trail from here okay. before the sea. Yeah. And they will take you all the way onto the treasury. Okay. Up on the top. Yeah. You will take picture the same one. Yes. And then he's going to lift you near the treasury. And uh, after then, it's a bit of you. If you like to continue. Oh, somebody will take me on horse. Of course. You oh. cannot go by yourself. Okay. Wow. But Where will I find the horse? You can tell me. Oh, okay. I will give you my friend. Okay, good, good, good. Just only sorry, the yeah. left you oh, near to the yeah. treasury, yeah. Yeah. and then you will come back. Uh, Everything is gonna be like seventy. Seventy? Uh, yeah. Can, we, we can't go by ourselves. No, uh, you lost the way. It's not allowed. It's far away if you're gonna walk. But in the horse ride, it's yeah. gonna be shorter time for you. How long? In the horse, like forty minutes. Hey guys, so we just grabbed the shawarma here. Yeah, it's a takeaway restaurant, $5 shawarma, looks pretty good. Oh, there's a cat here too. Hey buddy. Uh, it's a little bit late, we got here a bit late. Uh, it's around four o'clock, but I think the site is open till six. And then we're also gonna be doing Petra by night where you can see Petra in the nighttime and they light it up with candles, it's really nice. She wants food, I think. What's up, bro? I think so. Here. Okay, no, that's Maybe cool. That's cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are we going the right way? Oh, it's this way. Wow. I'm gonna take out like 300 today. On the way to the treasury, you will encounter hagglers who are looking to sell you on either horse or donkey rides, so you don't have to walk. They are pretty persistent, even when you tell them that you aren't interested. The hotel staff did apologize in advance and mentioned that this is their way of living, and due to COVID, they were impacted deeply. The best way to avoid them is to try to go in the morning or early afternoon, as they can become more persistent closer to closing time to make a sale. I might do horse. <laughs> no, bro. If 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 that's the case, I might come with you. Can can we do a bit later? Six a.m. No, bro. He said it's six a.m. price. No. Oh. Let's ask him. I don't know. He gave me his number. Ask him in the morning. Uh, excuse me. Is the treasury this way? Yeah. Okay. Thank you.
Okay, thank you. Okay guys, so we're here at the treasury. We just made it. Holy shit. Wow. Thank you. We're coming tomorrow. Okay, my name is Ahmed Mohammed. Okay. Uh, it looks like they started on these ones, but they never completed them. Okay guys, so we just did the, uh, the treasury, very cool. And now we're walking to the theater. Uh, so I'll just flip it one more time. Not sure if you guys can see it in this, uh, in this shot here, but uh, you can see the steps of the theater. Uh, not sure how much this one holds. I think this one is more uh, larger than the one in Amman. Okay, so here is the Petra Theater. It used to hold 4,000 people, so it is actually smaller by about 2,000 people, I believe, versus the Roman Theater in Amman. Because we got to Petra quite late and the park was closing at 6 o'clock, we planned to do the monastery the next day. So we started to make our way back towards the hotel and would return in the evening for Petra by night. As you can see, they're setting up uh, Petra by night. So they got the candles in there. Bit of a hike. This is the main central area of the Petra park. So there's the Petra Visitor Center as you can see and I guess this is the entry point. So they have some restaurants here. We grabbed the shawarma from here, takeaway restaurant, it was a good shawarma. They got a few pizza places as well. Pretty cool. And up there you can see that there's the Petra Museum. And then you have some landscape in the back. So when you enter Petra, that's actually where you come up from. There's a mountain. So you drive your car all the way down and then the Petra, I guess, city or the village is just right here. Petra by night is a magical night show. The experience starts by walking the entire sick to the treasury, lit with over 1500 candles. 
At the Treasury, you are then welcomed to a spectacular light show on the Treasury, along with musical entertainment and a cup of delicious Bedouin tea. Stars are all out tonight. That was fun guys, they gave us some tea as well, amazing tea, so that was Petra by night, just heading back now. <laughs> 